The 48th Annual Daytime Emmy Awards airs tonight at 8 on KPIX 5 and Paramount Plus. And earlier, I caught up with two of the nominees. I do want to first congratulate the both of you for this honor. I mean, this is so awesome, outstanding performance by a lead actress. How excited are you? We are so thrilled. This is such an exciting time. You know, last year we had the Emmys and it was on Zoom. So this is the first time that we all get to be back together. We get to dress up. We have that sense of community again. So again, just to be nominated, I'm so proud of the cast and the crew. And, and just, but again, just to be with everyone this year is super exciting. You know, I'm looking at the um, I'm looking at the other actresses in this category. I mean, Jeannie Francis, Fanola Hughes. These are veterans who have been around a long time. It's a great class to be a part of. It really is such an honor. I'm like pinching myself. We all got to do um, this an annual uh, leading ladies luncheon last week, so it was like so surreal to be like part of the club. Uh, obviously, Jacqueline's won, so she's done it before, but I had never been there and I didn't really know the ladies until I went and it was so special, so many laughs. Um, and I just couldn't believe I was at a table with them all. Like it was so cool. So it's and all telling like their stories. Like yeah. it was, we both were having like pinch me moments, you know, okay. just, it was, yeah, pretty incredible. Oh, I yeah. bet that was incredible. Um, okay. So you mentioned this about last year, completely different. Now things are starting to open up. We're seeing, you know, people who are going to be on stage, which is so nice. How exciting is that to just know that you can be in person and, you know, you're going to see these performances or these uh, presenters that you haven't seen in person for a long time. Girl, we get to wear high heels for the first time in like a year and a half. That's really exciting to just all be together, to all get, get glamorous. You know, so much of the daytime community is about glam. So being able to dress up and have the fans see it for it to be on national television on CBS is such a big deal. Pick up streaming on Paramount Plus. Um, it's just so great to be together and feel that sense of community again. And it's so good for the viewers and the fans, too. Let me just tell you, because my friends and I, we watch a lot of award shows. And, you know, we want to we want to hear, of course, from the, the actors and actresses. But we also want to see the fashion. So we are pretty excited about that. Um, let's talk about your shows respectfully. First, let's talk about The Young and the Restless and what's going on with Chelsea. Uh, Chelsea has been in a bit of a predicament pretty much for the past, like, 10 years. Uh, but recently she's been in the mental hospital after she faked the breakdown to avoid jail time, you know, naturally. So um, right now she's scheming and trying to, you know, manipulating her way out. So uh, there's some blackmail going on. So I'm excited for the fans to see how she manages to find her way out of the mental hospital. Stay tuned. Oh, we can't wait. Jacqueline, how about Steffi? Steffi is in a really good place right now. She's there awaiting her and Finn are awaiting the arrival of their son, uh, which will be July 1st. So I'm so excited for the viewers to see it because it is something special. When we filmed it, it was beautiful. So I can't wait for them to all see. And Steffi's just, yeah, she's in a good place. She's truly in love. She's, you know, it took years for her to really get over Liam. So it's nice to have someone new in her life and to keep it spicy. Yeah, and hopefully it sticks. But, you know, with the soaps. Things always change. Oh, fingers crossed. I know. <laughs> Very I know. Rapidly. You're hoping. <laughs> <laughs> You're hoping. All right. Well, again, congratulations to the both of you. Good luck, and we'll be watching. Thank you. Thanks so much. All right. Have a great day. Me too. You too.